peace reflection. I hope you all doing great. I am evolving every single day as you can see and I just wanna you know say welcome to you all my reflections you know welcome until I say something I'm going to wait for a couple of more of my reflections to come in room you know welcome welcome my reflections welcome come Come, we're going to like dive deep today, you know. I got like these things is very important for I to really know, you know. And I wanna share, you know, like I just, you know, you read it. Um, what I wrote there, like if you're alone, if you're afraid to be alone. And this is the question, like, are you afraid to be alone? I know, like, I'm going to share with you from my earlier journey. I was very, you know, in my earlier journey when I was not loving myself enough and when I was not taking, my, so, taking care of myself enough, that is when I was very afraid to be alone. I didn't wanted to be alone you know I didn't want to to be alone uh, I needed people around me all the time you know back in the time and what I want to say is that you know I love to be alone now because I realize this is the healthiest time you can have is with yourself when you're alone when you can spend time alone with yourself when you can enjoy your uh, self company you know you, when you love yourself enough that's when you really enjoy your own company you know that is when you don't wait for someone to meet you up you know My, the best thing you know, best thing you can do every single day is to spend time alone in nature or in a room. You have to be your own best friend, you know. You have to be your own best friend. You have to hear that inner voice, you know. You have to really love yourself 100%, you know. And... Uh, I know most of my reflection, they don't love to be alone. They always need someone. They always need someone talking in the phone or maybe they need someone to be with all the time. Even lots of people that are in relationship, you know, they don't want to let go of the person because they feel afraid to be alone. And that is lack of self-love. I just have to tell you, this is lack of self-love. Because if you cannot be alone with yourself, like that means that you were not in tune within yourself. You were not your best friend, but you were your own enemy. You know, so that is when I can tell you that you are not loving yourself. As, first of all, you have to love someone and that should be you first, you know. So when you love yourself, then you can love someone else, uh, other part of you, you know. But if you don't love yourself 100% and then there is like, you were in a relationship or maybe there are friends, you know, uh, you were attached to, you know, attachment bring pain in your life you know and at the same time uh when you're attached to them like i'm saying you will suffer more you will suffer more you will be lost lots in depression you know really you know because that means that you are not even loving your partner that you are with you are not even loving those friends that you are friend with because you are not f loving yourself because first you have to take care of yourself you know and at the same time i can tell you how do you love yourself you know 
And you can love yourself. How do you start to love yourself? By taking care of yourself. And you have to find your creativity back again. Because when you were a little child, you know, you were all the time enjoying your time with yourself. You know, nobody told you what to do. You were just running around and playing around. So much joy, so much happiness, you know. Nobody told you, hey, you have to play like this because you just found out stuff. And this is the creativity. So you have to go back to it again and find those things that you really love to do. Like, I can give you an example from me. Me, I love cooking food. I cook food, I enjoy it, I love to cook my own food and I love playing music instrument, you know. So instead of listening to so much of music, I rather pick up my guitar and I start to play and sing, you see. And what it means, I'm having connection with my guitar, I'm like, this is soul speaking, you know. So I'm so much in tune that that I describe all my feelings, all my thinking, all my speaking in it, in this tune. When I play, I speak, I sing out, you know. So that is how we are in tune. We create something together, you know. I am best friend with that, you know. In your lonely time, you have to really find yourself doing what you really love to do. Otherwise... Uh, you will end up feeling like lonely and alone. You ne always need somebody beside you, but that somebody takes your time, takes away your time from doing what you really love to do, you know. So you have to really think about these things and really be in tune within what you really love to do. You have to become your own best friend and in it you find stuff that you really love to do when you're alone in your room. Especially when you're alone in forest, like, try this. Every single day, go to nature. Like, going to forest for walk, sightseeing, river, go for walk all alone. Leave your phone home, you know. Leave your phone home. Don't take your mobile phone with you. Don't take nobody with you. Even if there are parents of leave your kids home too. Don't take anything with you but yourself only. Go for a work. When you go, just get get in tune in nature. And you do it, you do it. Then you will start to do something. You will start to really come in tune within yourself. And you will really start to do something while you were in nature like me. When I go for work, when I leave my phone, everything here in my room and I go for work, you know what I do after some time? Like I become so much in tune, I smile, I smile, I breathe, I observe the moment, I look at all the colors around me, I get, I get so much creative mind, like wow, I can paint it, you know, this, like... So much color and at the same time I'm so much in present moment, you know, like so much in present moment. I start to vibrate high and I just smile and sing. I sing. I say, even people are passing by, I don't care. I sing and they get happy too by seeing me singing. I start to dance, you know. So at the same time, I'm happy. I'm vibrating so high. So I am reflecting to the others too. So they find their joy whenever they see me, you see. Like, just, I'm just sharing myself to you. But whenever you take yourself to nature every single day, you will find your own stuff. By the time you will realize, wow, wow. Because when you hear your soul speaking, like you have to really be your own best friend. You know, otherwise you will just end up self-hating so much, you know, so much destruction. You will attract so much destruction in your life, so much suffering. And if you're attached to something, like, you know, attachment create pain. This is what I want to say to you, you know. 
don't be attached to nothing. Keep your pocket em empty, like really empty. You are walking in this path, so-called home. Why you have to carry so much while you're passing by? Why you have to carry so much stone and sticks inside in your pocket and make it heavier for yourself? Just look at it, play with it, then leave it there and move forward, you know? This is how it's supposed to be because life should be, life is not a suffering barrel. Life is not like something that you have to really force yourself to live or something. Life is just itself, you know, life is for living. Life is simplicity, you know, life is love, life. We are here every single day when you wake up. Do these three things, smile big, you know. If you cannot smile, then ask yourself why you were not smiling, why you were not full of energy, why you were not full of happiness. Because life is full of happiness, you know. Like me, when I wake up in the morning, like I'm like, wow, another day on planet Earth, you know, and I'm still alive. Because remember, this night when I'm going to sleep, Tomorrow, I don't know if I will wake up and many of my reflections, they transform themselves. Like me, as you know, me, I'm living in this body. And I don't know when I will transform myself from this body. So while I'm here, I have to really enjoy, you know, 100 percent, you know. So I cannot be attached to anybody, but. We are human beings, we get so much attachment like to our families, our lovers, our friends, our job, this and that, our things. Yeah, we do it, but try not to be attached to things because these things we will just leave behind. Rather, instead of thinking of the past, you know, you rather be here and now and thinking of now and be alive in the moment because when we were young, like, you know, kid, we didn't know what past it. We didn't even know what had it, had it is, you know, until someone came and programmed so many things into us. Like, it's like, damn, you know, it's not going in there, you know. So what, what I want to say is that, you know, you really have to reprogram yourself and become the pure child again, you know, child again. If if many of you, if you are suffering in destructive relationship, just leave it and let it go. Because look, this is the secret that I've been found recently. I have to share it to you. Look, do you remember like what happened to you like for like three, four years ago? So look at you now. You are still living, you're so happy, like, hey, don't, you have to realize one thing, everything is, is that is coming, better things are coming all the time, because, you know, better things are coming all the time, better, better, better life just gets better and better and better and better, you know why, you know how. Uh, can you, can you, you can hear, um, can you hear me clear? Um, can anybody answer, like, if anybody hear me clear? Because George said that, can you turn your volume up? So is it disturbing, like, you know? Can you hear me? Okay, good. So, uh, what I want to say is that peace, new world, peace. Uh, you just sound, it sounds. Can you really hear me? Like, is it low or high? Ashley, can you hear me? Can you hear me good? Like, am I gonna take my phone more closer or is it good enough? 
or should I speak louder? Hello? It's good. Okay. So, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. So what I want to say is that, you know, we have to become the pure child again. You see? And pure heart. Because with pure heart, you can manifest anything. Like me. I can say better things are coming all the time. You know how? Because I got my heart clean you know i got my mind healthy you know because i i'm so much in tune within you see you have to become your greatest version every single day and leave behind all the toxic thing that hold you from really living your life and it can be from people job work your environment some materialistic stuff your thoughts like all the things you have to really repair it for something bright brightness you know and what i want to say is that you really have to be in tune within your heart again which is nature.